Today, I'm gonna cut my hair. So we're just gonna... Oh, I feel so free. This is so much fun. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was so much fun. Oh, that was way too much fun. Oh my god! Good thing, but... But it's, so much it's going I short, so. I should probably get those instead of crafts. Okay, question. So, why is it I literally just cut off like a tiny piece of my hair that it just feels like so nice and like soft? How does that happen? Oh, this is so much fun. We're only one minute and seven seconds into like my journey, and I'm already having a good time. These scissors. I don't know how much they are. I mean, these were just in my house. They're probably like only three dollars. Three dollars worth of fun. Cutting your hair should not be this much fun. But it is. First of all, I have to explain the importance of a good scissor. If you cut your hair at home, which I don't recommend, you go to the hairdresser, but still, I get a lot of reactions of people that say, I cannot afford a hairdresser. And I see prices especially in, uh, in America, uh, that is, it's really expensive. It's more expensive than in Europe. For some people, I, I can get it that it's too expensive to go to a hair uh, salon. My tip is if you cut your hair at home, don't cut it with a craft scissors. Don't do that. Always I see these people cutting their hair with craft scissors. Have you ever been to a hairdresser that is cutting your hair with this? No! No! Why? Why should you use this? Because you're suddenly uh, thinking about I'm cutting my hair and oh, uh, a scissor, I need a scissor. And you go into your kitchen drawer and, and, and get this. If you want to cut your hair, prepare yourself and buy you some quality scissors. So this is mine. This is mine. I, I like it. I like it a lot. It doesn't have to be this expensive as our scissors because um, the scissors that we are using in a hair salon are really, really expensive. But it doesn't have to be that expensive. You have hair scissors that are less expensive. So buy them so you can cut your hair more nicely. With this one, it, it's, it's not possible to do a, a good haircut with this kind of scissors. It's not possible. So. That's my first tip for today. If you want to cut your hair, buy some good scissors. This girl has a lot of fun. And the reason that she chops off all these pieces randomly is because she's going short. She's going pixie. So all she's doing now is just having fun. It's having no effect of uh, her hairstyle later on. So it's going to be this short. Pixie is this short. So. She's cutting now, so she's just having fun. Don't cut your hair. Like, no. <laughs> I'm gonna do it because it makes me happy. I'm gonna go more drastic. I'm just having fun and doing a little trim right now. Just evening out all the mess that I made from the last time I cut my hair by myself. Um, but yeah, that was fun. Let's do more. So I have a little Pinterest board of like the pixie cut. I don't know if I want to do that. Already it looks so cute. I like it like this. That was just in the last two minutes how much was cut off. I mean, goodbye to that mess. I'm definitely gonna have to sweep in here after, but it feels so weird to, it's like so disgusting to see your hair not on your head. It's just like, why does this exist? Since I'm going very short, um, you have to section it off, right? Or else you're gonna be pretty screwed. Yeah. So what I'm doing is just like eyebrow end and just kind of going straight across because I saw somebody do that and I think that that's pretty legit. I didn't actually see somebody do that. I feel like that was something for something else, but it might have been this. I, I don't know. I have a lot of energy right now and I don't think that that's the best thing to have when doing something like this. Wait, I should probably do a middle part right now just so that it's nice and good and normal. Yeah, let's go with that. She has so much positive vibes. It's like, it's making me happy just watching at her. I know she's making wrong decisions because she, she has not decided yet 
which section she's going to make. I'm going to make a middle section. No, no, I'm going to make the side section with a pencil. For God's sake, with a pencil. If you do it like this, you will drawing like a line on your face. But it's, it's making me happy to, to watch her. But also a little nervous. But okay, 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 okay. Let's see what she's doing. I'm gonna go to the rice to get first. She's going for it! Oh, this is so much fun. Oh, this is so satisfying. Look at this. I asked my mom for permission, so it's fine. Hey mom, can I cut my hair? Not today. If you do like literally this much, but please don't cut it today. Okay, okay. I just go like this, like, hey. What's up? My name is Mia, and I like to cut my own hair. Don't you love cutting your own hair? It's my favorite thing to do in the world. Okay, but I am not a professional with this at all. Obviously. I do like doing my own hair, though. I think it's a really fun thing to do. It shouldn't be this fun. It really should, because it's this fun to do something. Oh. It's this fun to do something. Obviously, I'm gonna do it and make a day out of it. I mean, like, I'm a very impulsive person. If you know me personally, no! you know that I'm a very, like, just a very impulsive person. Um, Get out! This is probably the most impulsive thing I've done with my hair. Because, I mean, I just kind of picked up a cinders and went. But it. does she have any idea? Which direction she's going? Does she has a hairstyle in her head? What she wants? In the beginning, cutting off these long layers, it's okay because she's going short. But now she's really cutting it really short. I'm wondering where she's going. Does she has a picture in front of her? Where she... I'm speechless. Are you supposed to my your hair first? I feel like I saw that somewhere. That's fine. Why should I just go see? I don't think my mom was expecting this because I didn't tell her that I'm gonna get a pixie cut. No, she's expecting this. That I'm gonna cut my hair. I never told her how it was. I was like, Mom, can I cut my hair? And she's just like, make sure it's like conservative and stuff, but we're liberals. Anyways, so. What's your ears? She was like, just a little bit. Yeah, this is just a bit. I really think that this is only a tiny bit of hair. Why do I have so much energy? This is seriously a problem. This it is! so much hair. There's just a pile of it. <laughs> you never regret your life decision yet. Your regret is setting in now. I'm in the bathroom floor of the school crying. <laughs> and cutting off my hair because I'll never find love. <laughs> oh my god! Trust me, I don't have to deal with that kind of drama. <laughs> Am I right, kids? I hear my mom talking to her family on the phone. And I'm just like, <laughs> I'm up in the bathroom cutting my hair. <laughs> So we only have one bathroom in the house, so I have to scoot you. No, I was gonna say something else. Oh, I forgot. Anyways! Oh! Yeah, I'll put it Oh my house. god! I'll screen if I can find any. I think someone has drinking too much Red Bull. It's like she's jumping in, in every direction with the haircut, with the talking. It's like... That's right, that's right. I don't think it's working. Is that what they were doing? I don't remember. No, no. Dude, I have that song stuck in my head and I do not know the lyrics. That's annoying. It's, been... it's literally been 10 minutes and I literally, oh my gosh, if I went to the salon to get this song, they take hours. Welcome to my own salon where I just do whatever I want and call it a hairstyle. Yeah. Oh my god, she's crazy! Easter's next Sunday. I don't look good as a bald person. I mean, not as like a completely bald person, but like with this much hair on my head, 
like, Eleven coming for your brand season one. Also, Stranger Things coming out on July 4th. That's exciting. That is so exciting. Because, yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm so proud of myself. Um, <laughs> I'm just kind of getting an idea. Is my coat white back Oh, um, that's because I use dark shampoo a lot. Um, why does this side look so much different than the outside? And I'm just like, is that? I think it's a little bit longer on that side. Whatever, we'll just go with that. How does it look from the back? What does it look like? I'm, I'm excited to see. It's um, okay! It's it perfect! Feels so nice. It feels so good. I love it. I might like thin this up just a little bit. Wait, I have thinning scissors. I can do this. This is probably the first video I see that makes me very, very happy. I love her. It's really adorable person. I don't want to be with her all day. No. No. Too, too much. Too much. Oh my god, this is, this is really fun to watch. And I cannot give any more tips because it's all wrong. You know, don't just cut in there and, and the, the thinning scissors is just cutting inside is like a maniac. I'm speechless. I don't know what to say to give you the best advice not to do this. You know you, you cannot do this. If, first of all, if you want to cut your hair, you have to have an example right beside you on the mirror. Then you have to section it. Section. I explained it in another video. Section by section. Uh, a little point cutting, that's all the things you have to do but she's just cutting it, just go for it She's, but she's having so much fun, it's so it's so good to watch let's go, let's go at this hacking but hey, she's taking sections, she's taking sections <laughs> If you want to use thinning scissors, that's very good to blend the harsh cut that you just cut it. You have two different techniques. If you cut it, then you have a straight line and you can see that in the middle. So you have two techniques to blend that out. So if you blend it out, you can take your scissors and go inside the hair. That's called point cutting. And you go inside the hair. Don't don't do it like this, go straight in, you know, go straight in. If you do it like this, then you take big sections and again, you will not blend. So, inside, but watch out for your fingers, so you can point cutting or you can use a thinning scissor and then also blend it in. But now, she's using this thinning scissors 
for no reason at all. She's just saying, okay, I will take the scissors and I do this. She has no idea what she's doing. Watch your ears! Watch this! This is like gardening, you know, with the scissors, I will cut it in a round shape. It's gardening now we're watching. It's, it's way past haircutting now. It's haircutting 2.0, the next level. Let's, maybe I learned some new techniques now. And I think this will be good for me. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go for it. Yeah, go for it. Just do whatever with your hair that you want because you only live once. So let's just reincarnation something, but it is like off of my head. You know? Oh my god! Honestly, it's hurting me! Just, I'm just gonna... Yeah! Just do it! 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 Just do it!
She has a very beautiful face. Stop now! Okay, not texturing. Saw somebody too crisp. Texturing. Texturing. How? They did. I remember seeing them doing it. Yeah. Yeah, this is something we do. To do this technique, you have to use a very good and expensive hair scissors. It's called sliding, texturizing. It's like if you do it with a very bad scissor, it's not working. You have to have a scissor that it's cutting very good to have this kind of technique. She has watched some uh, professional hair videos. Yes, it's a technique we do, but for at home, Hmm, you have to have a very good scissor to do that, but it's really funny to watch. That looks so cute and clean. That's really nice. Oh, Travis, not supposed to happen. Oh! That's like, it really doesn't matter. It just, it doesn't matter. You can do anything. As long as. Crazy deep point cutting! Woo! You have the ability to. You, I'm not explaining this in a way that makes sense to me personally, but I hope that it makes sense to you. No. Um, I'm gonna clean all this up, take a picture of all of, all of this, post it to Instagram, put a towel on my head, and go downstairs after I chop that bit off. Again, you're crazy deep, but yes. Mom's reaction! So did you like Let's the go. present I gave you? We're freaking out a little bit. That's a lot of hair. <laughs> yeah. What did you post? I said, oh goodness gracious, Mia just came down the stairs with a towel in her head and hand does this. With it on his head. <laughs> Do you want to see it? Okay. <gasps> oh my gosh, Mia! Yeah, it is so short! I will see you in the next video. Later. Subscribe. Okay! If you're going to look closely, it will be a mess. It will look good when she crunch it with a lot of uh, volume and a lot of movement inside so you don't see it. But it will be like it's not blended. But with her crazy deep point cutting technique, it's blend a little. I'm very happy she has both ears uh, still attached to her head because this is... This is really dangerous what she's doing like this one. So I would say drink less Red Bull um, because it was really, really crazy video, but it was really fun to watch. Go to her channel, please, please, please go to her channel, subscribe to her channel because I think you have a lot of fun watching her videos. I believe so. Did you think this was a good video? Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, press that notification bell, and all I'm going to say today is... Chaukas!